Hey, what's going on, everyone? Neil here from Creative Plastics in Sacramento, California. And we've got another new enclosure coming. Uh, I think you guys are going to be stoked. This is a has been, in the past, a super-duper popular printer. And so far, what we've been printing with this new Creality Ender 3 V3, we're actually pretty stoked on it. Check this out. Okay, so here's Clearview's newest enclosure. It is for the Creality Ender 3 V3 3D printer. And if you're familiar with Ender 3s, uh, this one actually is totally different, it has a, the same build volume, but just about everything else is different. Um, and so for our setup, you know, the things that we wanted to accomplish is A, we didn't want to have, uh, we wanted, well, we wanted this to be easy to set up. We didn't want you to have to do any hard mods to utilize the enclosure. And then we also wanted it to be a good bang for the buck. So uh, I think the most prominent thing here is you can see that we are using the stock spool holder that comes with the Creality Ender 3 V3. And then uh, we've got our, um, our, our filament port on the side there that feeds over to the filament sensor. And that's the, been the easiest way to uh, just get set up. It just takes a few minutes uh, after you get this built. So uh, speaking of building the enclosure, uh, all of our panels are CNC laser cut, and it includes all the holes for the hardware. Uh, our kit includes all of the hardware. You can choose to either uh, have us print or you can print your own brackets uh, at home in the color and material that you choose. Um, but overall, we wanted this to be easy to build as well. So uh, with all these holes already being uh, pre-cut, pre all you really have to do is just uh, do all of the, well, we, these are all uh, what we call binding screws to, to put this together. And so all in all, setting this enclosure up takes, uh, you know, maybe about one to two hours, including getting the printer set up inside and everything up to printing. So uh, some of the things that we included, aside from the being able to use the stock spool holder, we also added in a filament port up on top. If you want to change the location from where your filament is feeding through, uh, this one is sporting our uh, external exhausting uh, HEPA carbon filter. This is the idea filter, fan and filter combo if you are printing with PETG, uh, PLA, uh, and TPU. As you can see on the back here, we've got our carbon impregnated HEPA filter that's replaceable and easily order on, orderable on Amazon for a very inexpensive price. And then on the back here, we also want to keep the electronics cool inside of the printer. So we put, we built in this, uh, what we call a cool air port to help uh, feed air under the printer. On the door here, this is again, all laser cut. And since it's laser cut, the curve for the gap between the door and the face frame is virtually nil. And so that makes it, that gives it a really clean look and makes sure that the printing environment stays inside. Uh, these magnetic, la mag magnetic latches are easy to operate and easy to attach. They're two pieces and then there's a little, there's some uh, magnets in there to help it clasp down. And uh, we've got options for uh, also metal hardware as well or a heavy duty hardware kit uh, that will upgrade the hinges and um, a, a, into a metal door pole and then heavier duty stainless hardware as well. And so to give you an idea of a lot of people are interested in the difference in sound. So uh, you can see that it helps with, uh, with, with the sound. This is actually built with our 1 8 inch uh, thinner acrylic panels as well. If you do step up to the quarter inch panels, it actually helps with the sound deadening just a little bit more. But the eighth inch panels are kind of the best bang for the buck. So one more thing I wanted to touch on 
with uh, the Creality and your audience, a lot of the times these are newer users and it, uh, the, they may not understand why you would even want to enclose your 3D printer. So there's basically three main reasons. The first and biggest reason for us is that you're creating a better print environment. So the, the being inside of the enclosure, then you are uh, basically making a nice dust free, clean air, and printing environment. So it helps your pr printer actually last a little bit longer and, uh, it, and it just keeps things nice and clean on the inside. The, the second reason is to enclose fumes and smells and it, and in, in, in VOCs. So, uh, as I mentioned before, we've got our external exhaust HEPA filter on there. So, it, if you aren't super familiar with 3D printing, some of the plastics can stink pretty bad. Uh, they're known to have VOCs, and so with long-term use, then some are considered about the adverse health effects. Now, uh, with our with our HEPA filter, that will help catch particulate that is made inside of the 3D printing process. So we print with a lot of PETG and over time, uh, our tool heads and our fans inside of it uh, on the printer will get, kind of get caked in this white powder. And so it essentially that actually goes all over the place if you are just printing out in an, in an open room. And so with, the, with our HEPA filter, that's designed to catch as much as possible. Um, and so it's our hopes that you can get a healthier printing environment out of this for yourself as well. So the last reason that you'd wanna enclose your 3D printer is actually just for a better 3D printing environment as well, in that the enclosure will help to retain heat and so then it, you'll have better success printing with advanced filaments. And actually, we think it helps to print even with your basic filaments like PLA and PETG as well. Because if you've ever had a print that, uh, especially on a longer print and a, and a larger print that warps on the edges, it's because of temperature differentials inside of, of your room that you're printing in. And so, with your uh, enclosure, then it, it homogenizes your, uh, it, your your print temperatures inside the chamber and around the printer, so you get less warping and a brighter print experience that way. And so that's Clearview's enclosure for the Creality Ender 3 V3 3D printer. We make a ton of different enclosures here for, at Clearview Plastics for a wide variety of printers, laser engravers. We actually even do custom works uh, for particular machinery that people want to enclose. Uh, we've actually worked with a ton of different clients from your average hobbyist to universities, Fortune 500 companies, the government, a wide variety. And we're a small business. We're appreciative people and we welcome all sorts and we'd love to see you come visit us at clearviewplastic.com. Thanks so much, guys. Peace.